on Thursday, March 4, 2021, at approximately 2.09 p.m., the Beverly Hills Police Department received a 911 call reporting a robbery and gunshots at a restaurant located in the 400 block of N. Cannon Drive. Beverly Hills Police arrived at the location within 90 seconds of the first call intended to an adult female victim suffering from a gunshot wound. The suspects had fled the location. After investigating, Beverly Hills Police detectives learned that a lone suspect had scouted the area, and identified a patron sitting outside the local restaurant wearing a high-end watch. A few minutes later, additional suspects arrived at the restaurant, targeted the victim, and violently demanded his watch using a handgun. A struggle then ensued between the victim, and suspects over the watch and handgun. Seated at a table adjacent to the robbery victim was the female victim who was struck by gunfire. She was shot once by a suspect, who fired approximately two rounds from the gun. Witnesses observed three suspects run from the restaurant east on Dayton Way. The weapon used by the robbery suspect was recovered at the scene. This robbery was a brazen attack during midday in the heart of Beverly Hills and endangered the lives of everyone in the area. Over 40 people witnessed this crime. Yesterday, detectives from the Beverly Hills Police Department, with assistance from the FBI and Santa Monica Police Department, arrested three suspects responsible for the robbery, assault with a deadly weapon. The arrests took place across Southern California. All three suspects were taken into custody without incident. The suspects are all from Los Angeles, Malik Lamont Powell, 20, Kai McGee, 18, Marquise Anthony Gordon, 30 The case was brought before the U.S. Attorney Office by the FBI, and a federal arrest warrant for all three suspects alleging conspiracy to commit interference with commerce by robbery All three suspects are currently being held at the Metropolitan Detention Center in downtown Los Angeles without bail. The magistrate will set the bail during the arraignment. Beverly Hills Police Detectives, along with the FBI, worked tirelessly on this case. The case was solved through witness statements, examining digital evidence, and DNA evidence recovered from the scene. This is an excellent example of modern police work, tenacious investigative work combined with technology, and a strong cooperative effort between the FBI and the Beverly Hills Police Department. The watch has yet to be recovered. Beverly Hills Police Detectives and the FBI are continuing their investigation regarding the location of the watch. The department wants to assure residents, business owners, and visitors that Beverly Hills remains one of the safest cities in the world. Criminal activity of any kind will never be tolerated in the city of Beverly Hills. Beverly Hills Police Chief Rivetti would like to thank the mayor and city council for their continued support and dedication to keeping the community safe, and would like to thank the department's law enforcement partners for helping to bring these suspects to justice.